Good morning, it's Tuesday the 2nd of January 2018, a new year and a new start because I am moving to London today, I'm waiting for the packers, I've got all of my clothes and stuff on the floor right here, um, so yeah they're going to come to my house first, package up my stuff and then head over to Alex's flat, collect his stuff and then we're all going to drive down to London and unpack. It's quite early um, so I think I've got like 45 minutes till they arrive. I think I've got everything sorted. I've got like toiletries, I've got clothes, I've got some bits for the kitchen and stuff like that. Because obviously I haven't come from a house, whereas Alex has come from a flat, so he's gonna have more stuff than me. Um, but yeah, I'm excited. I'm also a bit tired, because it is early, but I'm hoping to take you along with me. We are in, this is our mess. We unpacked a few things. Alex is trying to make a kitchen table. Do you, think, do you think it's gonna be possible? Yeah, of course. I'm not as stupid as I look. Oh, which is gonna go there. This is our kitchen. I bought some new things from HomeSense. Voila. Coming along, this is Alex's coffee machine. So we've been unpacking a few things. Obviously it's not perfect yet, but it's looking good. And then I'm in the bedroom making our bed up, which I will show you, is in here. We don't have the bed frame yet, so it's just a mattress. But we bought lots of nice sheets from John Lewis, so I'm deciding which sheets to put on. So we have no Wi-Fi or TV yet, so that comes next week. But then when that's all up, it will feel very homely. And then we just need to wait for our bed. And then we have a sofa arriving, so it should start feeling pretty homely in about two weeks. But like, this is all our stuff. We also need somewhere to put our clothes. But it's looking pretty good. I'll show you our bathroom. The bathroom. Started putting some stuff, sorry about my pajamas. Started putting some stuff in here. This is my side so far. And then, <laughs> Alex's side. So I better start putting all the sheets on the bed. I have made it with our sheets we got from John Lewis. We bought two sets of sheets from this very helpful woman at John Lewis. We got their crisp and fresh, oh my hair. Got their crisp and fresh range. And then we got their, and we've got on right now, which is the soft and silky, which is very soft and silky. So we just need an actual bed frame and then it will look like a real bed. We've got something to sleep on tonight because it's like, what time is it? I think it's 5.30 and we are going to go for dinner somewhere. And the worst thing you want to do is make your bed when you actually just want to get into bed. Paper cut. I always get paper cuts. Alex has completed the table after realizing it was not Dwell's fault. It was his own fault. But we have a table. We're just waiting for the chairs, which I believe come tomorrow. And then we can put all this stuff away and organize our kitchen. and I'm having a no makeup organizing unpacking day. I'm also waiting for the chairs to go with our table because uh, currently I've been sitting by the radiator over there. Um, but yeah, it's really nice. I'm really enjoying it. I'm enjoying setting everything up. I really enjoy when we've got all our furniture and I can start putting in like the soft furnishing. I feel like that's where the fun lies. Um, but yeah, we're looking kind of homely. I've got a kettle over there, tea, our fridge has like nothing in it apart from eggs. Um, Alex's coffee machine, which is actually really nice. Let me show you some stuff I have been doing, um, but I will show you probably when everything's really done, what everything looks like. But this is our spare bathroom, and I feel like this is probably where I'm gonna be doing makeup. So, this is like the only space with like a flat surface in the bathroom, which I didn't really realize that would be annoying. But this is sort of 
some makeup, some lipsticks, some concealers, some lip glosses, brushes, and then kind of foundations, bronzers, primers and mascaras. I didn't actually bring as much as I thought I was gonna bring. I thought that I was gonna bring loads of stuff and it was gonna be really annoying. That's not too much. And then if we go into our bathroom, just literally love this shower. How cool is that? Morning we had breakfast here. I made some scrambled eggs and we just sort of chilled. Alex has gone on a cycle ride because um, he needs to train for his race in Marrakesh, which is where he's going next week. And I actually think I'm gonna go home whilst he's away because I don't have anything to do here. Um, I need to film some videos and I need to get some more stuff and I need some internet, basically. We have no internet here or TV or anything. So I think being alone without a sofa, without a bed, without a TV, without internet, might be a little bit depressing. So with no internet, for the time being, I think I might read my book and wait for this parcel. we are going out for lunch i've been here for like two days and this morning we just went to the gym i went with my brother and today my dad is taking us out for lunch my dad actually lives in london but he's coming here because my brother's over from texas who plays tennis in america um and my dad hasn't seen him at all so he's coming here to take my brother out for lunch basically and because i'm here i get to go for some lunch too so i ain't complaining we went to the gym i'm just in something comfy because i didn't bring that many clothes with me um back from london like all my clothes are now in london and so is all my makeup. So I'm just like using random makeup that I left here. And my skin is not the best at the moment because I've been trying so many different beauty products, makeup products. And yeah, I've literally used a different cleanser every single night because I've got so many. I'm trying to figure out which ones I want to keep, which one I want to chuck. But I just don't think it's like good for your skin to keep rotating cleansers, moisturizers, makeup all the time. I don't know. It's good for your hair to keep changing shampoo and conditioner, but is it good for your makeup and your beauty products to keep changing them? I don't know. But yeah, I don't know why I'm sitting on the bathroom floor. My hair is also annoying me. I feel like I'm a bit of a mess. Like I've got the wrong makeup on, I've got random clothes on. My hair, I'm trying to grow my hair. And if you've ever had short hair, you'll know it's literally the worst thing to try and grow it. Like the back feels horrible. You don't know what to do with it. Like the fringe is sort of growing out. But I want like a little bob and fringe situation to come. So I have to wait it out. I have to be patient. But in the meantime, it's very, very difficult. But yeah. I should probably stop sitting on the floor and get my shoes on because we're driving to the nearby village because that is where we're having lunch. <laughs> What are you gonna have? A little Fanta, actually, please. Fanta, and I'm filming you. Dark coke. What are you gonna have? <laughs> DC. <laughs> Fanta on the rocks. Yes, please, pal. I 
I'm back at the flat and it's the most miserable day in London ever. Um, but I'm waiting for Alex to get back. He's training at the moment. He's off to Marrakesh tomorrow. So we've got one final day together and I think we're gonna go and try and find some like bedside lamps. I'm trying to make this feel a little bit more set up and homely. Um, but yeah, I'm just chilling here waiting. We still have no Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi comes on Friday. It is now Wednesday. So I just bought a new coat, obviously from Zara because I love Zara and I think they do the best coats. I really wanted like a warm cozy coat, which I did a whole haul, um, January sales haul and I bought a couple of other coats, but I still, I can't stop buying coats. And I feel like in winter, there is no limit to the amount of coats you can have. So let me just pop you here. Excuse the mess, but I'll show you my coat. So yeah, obviously we're still unpacking everything and I just got given some new like, cutlery from my dad. This is my new coat in this really nice bluey colour and you might recognise it because I did a Zara haul a while ago which I'll leave a link down below and I actually bought the maroon colour of this coat which I really liked but I ended up sending it back because I wasn't entirely sure on the colour and I never saw this like light blue and I think I really like it. Let me try and see if I can put you down somewhere you can see me from far away. Please do excuse the mess everywhere. But this is the coat. You can do it up. I have pockets that just need like unpicking. Um, but yeah. What do you think? Do you like it? I feel like it's just very warm and it's kind of a little bit more interesting than a dark coat. Um, but still kind of everyday wearable coat. So if anyone wants a life hack on how to drink more water, I drink so much water, it's because I use kind of like reusable bottles. This one I got sent um, when I worked with Nivea, and this is from Kate Spade, but she's got a little bee on it. And I just find that I drink so much more water if I drink it in a bottle or like a reusable cute cup like this one. So yeah, if you're looking to drink more water. Tell me about yourself. I was gonna say sofa, I said something about yourself. Go ahead. It's not really using the word to live. Just due to the fact that I went to the gym earlier. My legs are hurting. Mm -hmm. and we've been walking a long time around Speak a bit, a bit louder, please. We've been walking a long time around Pentacles. Mm -hmm. Starting to just reach the limit of wanting to hit the self destruct line. Yep. So, shall we evacuate having had no luck? Yes or no? Blaze isn't happy with what we're seeing, so we're I'm not happy time. with anything from here. Particularly not happy with that or that. Slightly happy with this. But it's not right for now. Okay. So we are back from shopping, a rather unsuccessful shopping trip. Um, but I'm the kind of person that prefers to shop online than in person anyway. We did manage to pick up some random boring bits. So we got some Tupperware and a big one. And also something for Alex, because he likes to eat healthy food on the go. So that's quite cool, look how cool that is. This is all from a shop. This is all from a shop, Hema. I feel like it's something to do with Tiger or Ikea or something, because it all looks the same as there. It's all quite cheap. And then I got some cling film. Very exciting. My dad actually gave me this, which is a blender, because I want to start making my smoothies that I have at home. So that's all the very exciting stuff that we got today. The kettle's currently boiling. Oh, just finished. So if you can hear that in the background, I'm really sorry. So I think I will leave this vlog here. And I hope you guys have liked this vlog. I think feel like it's been very kind of flitty. <laughs> I've been here, there and everywhere, literally. Um, and yeah, things will get a lot more exciting as we get more furniture. I'm really excited to show you some of the pieces that I've chosen and some of the stuff we're getting. So that's all very exciting. So that will be in my next moving vlogs. And I'm actually gonna vlog next week because I'm doing quite a lot of vlogging stuff, which is good because that all happens in London and before I had to come from the Cotswolds to London. So if you guys did like this video, please do give it a thumbs up and subscribe to keep up to date with what I'm doing over here on my YouTube channel.